Hello everyone and welcome back to another Splatoon 3 Gucci gameplay video. Um, thought I'd uh, commentate this one for you guys as, yeah, there's there's a bit to go through in this game. Um, specifically a lot of collaterals and not just, I think it was two or three collaterals, like pierce kills which is so satisfying. Um, so yeah, I just want to talk a bit about like what my thoughts were, what my plans were thinking and you know, what, to, what was my next. Uh, point of action. The first point of action was to stop and respond to a text message. Because <laughs> of priorities, am I right? <laughs> so I'm, yeah, just doing a quick response there. And uh, yeah, it really, um, it really threw me off that f this little bit because I was not settled. I was just doing like, a mad rush. Get a nice little early uh, partial charge killer there, which is nice. Um, but then, like a bomb awareness. I really want to bring back Bomb Sniffer or that whatever that ability was in Splatoon 1. <laughs> um, so, but yeah, so, so not paying attention too much to what the weapons that we're reversing against were. Uh, yeah, I'm still a bit, still a bit frazzled trying to figure out what the heck to do. I've um, got a nice trade there with I believe with the ends up. Um, just super jumping in early, just you know, to help the team get more pressure. Um, basically. You, what you want to be doing is not this, you don't want to be kind of in that area where you're caught behind or underneath a tower. If you can provide some support, that's great. Um, being in this position that I'm in now is not good. Yeah, Carbon was there. I don't know what, I, I remember playing this game and I remember doing that. I'm thinking, oh, this is a good idea. Not to think, hey, did you check who's spawning? <laughs> like, who's respawning? <laughs> but yeah, um, so basically, I think Right about now is where I've started. Yeah, there's our first collateral. And and then triple. Gets better though. I mean, this is a waste. I could have easily not done that. But hey, that's like five kills, right? <laughs> so yeah, this this kind of play really set the tone for the rest of the game. Um, Unable to really get much of a splat there, but you know, just trying to get in super positions where I can provide a bit of support fire and just try not to die. Which is amazing that that ends up didn't actually pressure me, although they do now. So the carbon actually, I think the carbon or the ends up got me. Ends up got me. Um, yeah. So this, for some reason, there was something about this game where I just kept getting collaterals, and I think I got, th I think I'm sure, like I said, the star got three. Um, the team really putting in the work here getting some chap damage on the dually scotches and just getting rid of the wave breaker just makes it a lot more comfortable. And also bomb awareness. Suction bombs man, I tell you what. <laughs> Give me that damn bomb sniffer ability. Uh, I jumped in here because I knew there was a there's a shield. So I would have been I think I would have been moderately okay. Swat they didn't actually go for me, like uh, there was a roll I think it was a carbon that was there. When we jumped in. Um, I'm just throwing torpedoes here just to get cheap damage, and as you can see, it helps the helps the result of someone getting a splat. Like, because gotta remember, torpedoes are so important for doing recon, like trying to find where the enemies are. And so, yeah, the more torpedoes you can throw, it, the better. Um, here's yeah, I I don't know why there there were two there. <laughs> so yeah, that was another dumb collateral. <laughs> A little bit lucky because I just was like, I'll oh, just stop it, go for the shot. Because I saw, I saw, I saw some movement because the someone had a tactical drink, and I just gathered like, okay, maybe someone's in that direction. Uh, yeah, what ends up, I killed him a few times. <laughs> but yeah, um, we get this push going to about 31, I think it was. Uh, yeah, I was a bit so direct to the carbon. Mind you, I, I, there was a lot of time available where I could have just looked, and I just didn't bother. So we got it to 39, I jump in just to get the tower, I count up a bit more, but I died to a Lunar Blaster. <laughs> but basically, yeah, at this cracked it, this cracked crazy roller just jumped in and rolled over two people. So it really is just a matter of just being in a defensive mind here, because they've got 55 seconds left, they really need to push hard. Um, backline support is like, just basically try to get some pain for your teammates, apply a bit of pressure with the laser. Yeah, at this point I'm like, why? Wow, this is so many collaterals! I think that's three collaterals. I don't know, editing Wacko, make sure you count. And there's another quad. 
just like that. That's like almost two quads in the game, if, if not more. <laughs> um, I was just tracking also is good. Yeah, that, 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 that kill was so satisfying. I thought I missed that shot initially. Because I saw the super jump, and then the hammer put me off. But I was like, no, stuff it, I'm going for the commit. And I got lucky. <laughs> oh, this is my favourite. It's so annoying. But, hey. <laughs> Torpedo kills. And then I went to go... Th I thought, oh yeah, I'll camp. I'll just camp this one guy. But, nah, don't need to. Don't need to. Wasn't needed. But, yeah, that was a pretty crazy game. And, yeah, I think it was 21 kills or something ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. All those collaterals. Overall splatter and enemy splatter. Just a nuts game. Yeah. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Um, if you enjoyed this video, uh, let me know in the comments below. Leave a like, subscribe for more Gucci gameplay videos. And I'll be sure to show you some tips and tricks as well if you're still interested. But yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you on the next one.